Yeah, well, you know, once we get that ice storm or snowstorm yeah, in the winter, we won't even be thinking about the heat advisory right. that we have no. today. But we're in, living in the moment, and it's definitely uh, hot outside and dangerously so for many of you. So take those precautions again today. As we look outside right now at Clyde Warren Park, lots of sunshine and just a few of those white puffy clouds, but those are not the rain producers. Temperatures are approaching 90 here at the 11 a.m. hour, 89 in Dallas, 88 in Mesquite and Grand Prairie, 87 in Duncanville. And the afternoon forecast shows how hot it's going to be. First of all, how hot it will be and then how hot it will feel. This is a number in white is the actual temperature approaching 100 today, but the feels like to our bodies 105 in the shade. If you're out in the sunlight, you could basically add 15 degrees to that number. It's going to feel more like 120 in the sunshine today. Heat advisory for basically the eastern two thirds of North Texas. This is today and tomorrow with those feels like numbers above 105 to as high as 108. And I do think likely we will see the heat advisory extended on into Friday as well. So ways to beat the heat, and we've been talking about this. I just mentioned not being in the sun. Don't exercise outside in the afternoon either, and drink more water than you think you need to. Uh, your body is really trying to cool itself through uh, sweat, but it's hard to evaporate that sweat out with this humid as it is, so you need more water to replenish. Light-colored, loose-fitting clothes, and make sure you're checking on your elderly friends and neighbors. And we really want to see how you can beat the heat here in North Texas. So send us a photo or a video. We'd love to put it on the air. You can tweet me, CBS 11 Jeff Jam, or find me on Facebook at meteorologist Jeff Jamison as well. Today we're going to top out near 98, 99 degrees. That heat index number up to 105, and no rain in the forecast for today. Tomorrow, basically a repeat. If anything, will be a bit hotter near 100 or 101. One. By the time we get to Friday, still hot. I'm still forecasting highs above 100. But notice on our future sky forecast, a cold front that's getting closer to us Friday afternoon. I do think by Friday night and especially on Saturday, we'll have at least some scattered storms around. And with that front pulling through our area, look how much we cool off over the weekend. Now, this is still late July, so it's not going to be cold, but highs are a little bit more tolerable in the mid 90s. We'll be in the lower to mid 90s early next week.